Hello, students. Good evening. Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? Very good, teacher. Thanks. Good evening. Okay, welcome. Welcome, everybody. Welcome to our class. It's a pleasure to have everybody here. Welcome. Hello. Okay. So I can see Elba, Julio, Noemi, Mr. David, Carlos, and Anna. Excellent. I can see everybody connected today. Great. I think I don't have the correct light, but it's it's okay. Okay, there I go. Here we go. Well, today, my dear students, we are going to continue working on the topic that we uh, that we have been studying. What has been the topic of the week? Who can tell me a little bit about it? What have we been studying? What has been the topic? ¿Qué hemos estado estudiando? Ah. Huh? Months and dates. We have been studying months and dates. Very good. What else have we been studying? What has been the grammar topic of the week? Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening, Ingris. What has been the grammar topic of the week? Is it the yeah. verb to be? Is it a simple past? What is the topic that we have been studying? Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, Anna. Going to. Going to, right? We have been studying going to. In which cases do you use going to? To talk about what? For future plans. For future plans, right? We use going to for future plans. Very good job. So we have been studying, we have been studying going to. And based on this one, we are going to work on this one, right? We have been studying going to. I am going to write it here. Going to has three specific forms. What is the what are the three specific forms of going to that we have been studying? Ah, este es el repaso, a ver si toman nota. Yes, no questions. <laughs> yes, no questions. Uh -huh. We have yes, no questions. WH question. We have studied WH questions. And simple sentence. Okay, we have studied simple sentences in what forms? Simple sentences in affirmative. We have studied in. also negative. Negative, and we have been studying also affirmative. The interrogative, right? We have yeah. been studying simple sentences in affirmative, negative, and interrogative. Good. So we have studied all these during these days. So as we have been working on this, I need you to give me examples of a sentence. Can you give me one sentence about one activity that you are going to do right now? What are you going to do right now? I am going to receive a English class. Very good. I am going to receive an English class. Fantastic. Right? I am going to receive an English class. Tell me something that you are not going to do. I am going to receive an English class. One thing that you are not going to do. I am not going to watch a movie. <laughs> I am not going to watch a movie, right? You are not going to watch TikTok. You are not going to check on Instagram right now. You are going to receive a class. I am not going to watch a movie. Good. And 
tell me one thing that your friends are going to do. So you say, my classmates. Can you complete that sentence? My classmates. Are going to receive an English class. Aha, uh -huh. my classmates are going to. Tell me one activity that we are going to do in class. My classmates are going to. Write a sentence. Right. Very good. My classmates are going to write sentences. Very good. My classmates are going to write sentences. And let me see. Tell me one sentence about Elmer. What do you think Elmer is going to do? Elmer is going to, right now, study, right? Elmer is going to study. Elena, what is Elena going to do? Sympathy. Elena is going to? Sympathy. Well, sympathy is, a, it, it is good, but we need to, to, to make it. going to listen. Excellent. The class English. English Very class. good. We need a verb, right? We need the verb to complete the class. Elena is going to listen to the class. Elena is going to listen to the class. What do you think Carlos is going to do? Carlos is going to... What is Carlos going to do? To... Carlos is going to read Carlos, the, uh -huh. the book or He's the going to book. read the agreements of the class. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Carlos is going to read the agreements of the class today. But he read them <laughs> yesterday. El no el día de ayer. Oh, sad. <laughs> Let's see. Jorge Luis. Oh no, Jorge already helped us in that. Jenny. Jenny is going to help us today to read the agreements of the class. Can you help us, Jenny, to read agreement number one, two, three, and four? I'm going to recite an English class. Yes, I need you to help me to read the agreements of the class. I am going to share them with you. There you go. Can you help me to read? Practice. Practice your English as much as possible. Very good. Elena, number two. Ask for help we need it. Uh, Daisy, number three. Keep your cameras on all the time. Very good. Juan Eduardo, number four. Keep microphone. Of microphones the, microphone of if we are not using them. very good david number five and all your session on time excellent let's continue with let me see elba number six fantastic julio number seven a cooperative attitude during class. Cooperative attitude during class. Attitude. Very good. Attitude. And Anna, number eight. And me. <laughs> yes. Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. Fantastic. Very good job. Excellent job on the agreements. You see, you don't have difficulties to read them anymore. Solo el primer día nos trabamos, o ya nadie se traba. That's very nice. Very good. So, we were talking about the different sentences with going to. Important, yesterday we were talking about the organization of the different parts of the sentence. Remember, the verb, in this case, the subject, going the verb to be, going to, and the verb, right? In a simple sentence. In a question, if you have a WH form, the subject, sorry, the verb to be, the subject, going to and the complement. So we need to be very careful with that part of uh, 
the sentences, right? And we were studying that yesterday, right? We were studying the different forms of the questions and also the different time expressions that we can use with the questions, right? The time expressions like tonight, tomorrow, tomorrow night, next week, next month, next summer. Tomorrow. Todas las expresiones tienen que ser para futuro. No podemos decir, what are you going to do yesterday? Because that is illogic, right? ¿Qué vas a hacer ayer? Well, I don't know, I have to travel back in the time. Right? It has to be for the future. It has to be for the future. The time expressions have to go based on the future. So here I have a little example of the sentences with going to and the time expressions. I have two examples. Mr. Julio, can you help me to read the two examples, the first two examples? He isn't going to read a book tomorrow. Well, the two examples, this one. Ah, very good. He isn't going to read a book tomorrow. And example number one, we David. Are going to, oh, sorry, go oh, ahead. Continue, excuse continue. Me. Uh, we are going to play next week. We are going to play next week. As you can see here, you have the subject, the verb to be, going to, the normal verb, and the time expression, right? And here you have the subject, the negative, going to, the normal verb, the complement, and the time expression, right? So here you have two, four, six, eight examples. On these eight examples, I need you to work on them. You can make it affirmative or negative. I need you to complete the sentences on your notebook. Okay, I need you to complete the sentences on your notebook and in later, I am going to ask you to read one example. So you have to work on the eight examples. And you can have an affirmative sentence or a negative sentence. So you can say, they are going to go on holidays at the weekend or they are not going to go on holidays at the weekend. It can be affirmative or negative. Right now, I am going to give you one minute for you to work on the eight sentences. Only one sentence, okay? <clears throat> La vamos a copiar todas, pero solo afirmativa o negativa. Depende. Si la quiere hacer afirmativa, si la quiere hacer negativa. Pero tenemos que hacer las ocho. Go ahead. Okay, when you finish, let me know, please.
Okay, did you finish? Yes. Perfect. Yes. Okay, Mr. Julio, give me your example for number one. Um, they are going to go surfing on Friday. Very good job. They are going to go surfing on Friday. The next one, David, can you read one of the examples? He is going to ride his bike next week. Very good job. Anna, go ahead. They are not going to surfing on Friday. They are not going to go. They are not going. They, they are going not. They are not going to go surfing on Friday. Very good. Very good. Elba, give me one of your examples. We are going to dance tomorrow. We are going to dance tomorrow. Very good. Let's see. Let's continue with Noemi. Can you give me one of your examples? They are going to play football on Wednesday. They are going to play football on Wednesday. On Wednesday. Wednesday. Very good. Carlos, give me one of your examples. The microphone, sweetie. Uh, where is it going? We is, we, we is not going to go shopping. We is, we is, se puede ocupar is con we? No. 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 <laughs> we are. are. Okay. We are going to shopping. We are going to go. We are going go to go shopping, shopping at, at the weekend. The very good. Corrijámoslo, Carlos, para okay. que no nos equivoquemos. Very good. We are not going to go shopping at the weekend. That's fantastic. That's fantastic. We are learning here. That's very good. Mr. Eduardo, can you give me one of your examples? He isn't going to ride a horse next week. Very good. He isn't going to ride a horse next week. Excellent. Elmer. They are going to swim on Friday. They are going to swim on Friday. Very good. Elena, give me your example. I don't see the next uh, example. Oh, you cannot see the examples? Mm, no. No oh, teacher, no. Really? Why? Yeah. You cannot see the examples right now. Eh, sí, pero el siguiente no, no se ve. Ah, no, 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 no. Ok, don't worry. Pueden leer cualquiera de los anteriores, no hay problema. Uh, ok. Eh, no, I think they... that's the last one. Continue, okay. continue. Eh, he is going to ride his bike next week. He is going to ride his bike next week. No, hasta ahí llegan, ya no hay otra. <laughs> okay. Okay. There, there you go. Very good. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. I am missing. Mr. Joaquin, give me one example. De los que ustedes escribieron. No importa que se repita. The microphone, Mr. Joaquin. Sorry, teacher. Don't worry. They are going to go on Friday surfing. They are going to go surfing on Friday. Go on Friday surfing. No, no, no. They are going to go surfing on Friday. La preposición de tiempo siempre va al final. Okay. okay. They, they are, are going to go the surfing on, on, Friday. on Friday. Very good job. Ingrid, give me your example. Okay. Where are no going to shopping at the weekend? We are not going to go shopping at the weekend. We are not going to go shopping. Mr. Jorge Luis, go ahead. 
Okay, teacher. They aren't going to play football on Wednesday. On Wednesday. 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 Very Wednesday. Good. Emily, give me one example. Emily, go ahead. Uh -huh. We are going to go shopping at the weekend. We are going to go shopping at the weekend. Wilfredo, give me your example. The microphone will work. On holidays. Okay, can you repeat because you didn't have the microphone on? They're going to go on holidays at the weekend. They are going to go on holidays at the weekend. Very good job. And Let's see, Rocio is going to be the last one. Go ahead. We are not going to dance tomorrow. We are not going to dance tomorrow. Very good job. Excellent sentences, my dear students. We need to be very careful on pronunciation, right? Little uh, details on pronunciation only, right? Remember, Wednesday, Wednesday. And you say, I am going to go to right, when you are going to go shopping to a specific place. Well, so we have here different examples of different days of the week, right? We have different activities to do every single day. For example, we can say that on Monday, I have this activity. On Tuesday, I have this other activity, right? On Wednesday, I have this activity. On Thursday, I am going to uh, Okay. On Friday, I am going to clean. On Saturday, I am going to study. And on Sunday, I am going to read. So if you need to give me sentences with the things that the teacher is going to do during the week, how can you create these sentences? These are the activities of the teacher. What is the teacher going to do on the different days of the week? My teacher is going to shop in on Monday. My teacher is going to shop on Monday. Any other form that we can give to this sentence? My teacher is going to go shopping on Monday. Perfect. Right, we have the two forms. My teacher is going to shop on Monday and my teacher is going to go shopping. Wilfredo, give me another sentence. My teacher is gonna eat a pizza hut on Thursday. <laughs> my teacher is going to eat a pizza hut on Thursday. Yes, we're going to go, all, all the class is going to go to pizza hut. <laughs> okay, my teacher is going to eat a pizza hut on Thursday. Very good. Another example. So we finish with my my teacher is going to go visit dentist to a say. My teacher is going to go to visit go the to dentist visit. on Tuesday. 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 Okay. Or another form of that sentence. Who can give me another form for sentence number two? Number two. Mm -hmm. Because the example that we have from Daisy is like my teacher is going to go to visit the dentist on Tuesday. My teacher is going to clean at the fry. Well, we have another one, but can we say at the Friday? 
or on Friday? Or, or. Okay. on Friday. On Friday, right? On. For the days of the week we use on, on Friday. So my teacher is going to go to the dentist, right? My teacher is going to go to the dentist on Tuesday. What about the other ones? We have Wednesday, Saturday, Sunday. Going to go to sleep. The teacher, the teacher is going to is going to go sleep on okay. Wednesday. Okay, aquí me ponen en un, en un problema. Si me dicen, my teacher is going to go to sleep, es que voy a dormir a otro lado. And yes. that's a problem. So no. my, teacher, my teacher is going to... The sleep the sleep. Okay, the my sleep. teacher is going to sleep the in going the normal walk. form, right? Imagine <laughs> if you say my teacher is going to go to sleep, where? Me, teacher, <laughs> may, may, maybe you are going to sleep with your mom. <laughs> with your sister <laughs> in attack correct <laughs> yeah <laughs> my teacher is going to sleep on wednesday good what about saturday what is the teacher going to do on saturday uh, my teacher going to study on saturday my teacher is going to study on saturday right here you have my teacher my teacher después ponemos el verbo to be is going to study, después de going to, el verbo normal, y después ponemos cuando. My teacher is going to study on Saturday, right? My teacher is going to study on Saturday. And on Sunday, what is she going to do? My teacher is going to read a book on Sunday. On Sunday. My book. My teacher is going to read an English book on Sunday. Yes, I love to read and I am going to do that on Sunday. So right now we are going to work together, right? We are going to work together and I am going to send you to working groups. In the different groups, what you are going to do is to create the activities that all the group is going to do together, okay? Imagínense que toda la semana van a estar juntos. Toda la semana van a estar juntos el grupo. What are you going to do on each day of the week? So you have to create a list of activities that the group is going to do on the different days of the week. Uh, we are going to go to the disco on Monday. We are going to do this on Tuesday. We are going to do this today on Wednesday. You are going to create activities that all the group is going to do together, okay? So we are going to create little groups and you are going to invent activities that you are going to do together. So please discuss them in English for sure, right? I don't want people to speak in Spanish on the groups. So discuss the activities and create the calendar of activities that the group is going to do on these seven days that you are going to be together. Tienen gastos pagados, así que pueden hacer lo que quieran. No hay límite de dinero porque todos tienen la black card abierta. So you can do whatever you want. If you want to go, I don't know, to Disneyland on Monday, it's your decision. You are going to do it, okay? So let's go to the groups and I need you to create your calendars. Go ahead, go to your groups. There you go. Accept my invitation to go to the groups. There you go, there you go. Excellent, let's go to the groups. Group number five is complete. Group number four is complete. Group number three, Wilfredo, can you enter to the group, please? And Janita, can you enter to the group?
Wilfredo, did you receive the invitation to enter to the groups? Mr. Wilfredo? Hello, Mr. Wilfredo, did you receive the invitation to enter to the groups? Hello, hello. Wilfredo, hello. Okay, we are waiting for Mr. Wilfredo to enter to the groups. And then we are going to go and check the different students that are on each of the groups. Hi, did you receive the invitation to enter to the groups? There you go, fantastic. Okay, so now all my students are in the different groups, creating the calendar of activities that they are going to do during the week. With this activity, they are going to practice the use of going to in real life situations. So let's go and see how they are doing. Mr. Josue, did you have a problem with the groups? Hello, teacher. Hi, the students are working in groups. I am going to send you uh, to work on a group of, of students, okay? Okay, pero es que, teacher, yes. en estos momentos me, me uniendo, no sé si me puede explicar qué es lo que estaban haciendo, porque estaba haciendo unos deberes. Okay, so, eh, as you can see there in the board, como ves en la pizarra, tenemos un calendario con todos los días de la semana, ¿sí? Sí. Okay. Uh -huh. What we are going to do is to create sentences using going to about the different activities that you are going to do each day. ¿Qué actividades van a hacer en cada uno de los días? Pero las van a decidir en grupo. Así que te voy a enviar a uno de los grupos para que puedas practicar con ellos. ¿Ok? Ok, teacher. Gracias. Ok, let's go. Let's go to the group. There you go. Now we are going to go and see how the students are doing with the activity in groups. Dance. Dance. Shopping, except me. Shopping, excellent shopping. Hello. <laughs> Did you finish? Um, no, teacher. I don't know. <laughs> okay, trabajemos pues. Solo a David veo conectado con su cámara. ¿Dónde están los otros? No me lo dejen solito. Estamos de incógnitos. Continue working. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> Uy, vamos a regresar. Solo nos falta el sábado y el domingo. Saturday. No, don't worry. I am checking on your work. Estoy revisando qué están haciendo. Oh. <laughs> we are what? Ah, we are, <laughs> we are you, going to go. <laughs> I, am a, I am a spy. <laughs> go ahead. Spy. Continue working. Continue working. We are, we, we are going to go. Sí. Huh? Sí. We are going 
We are going to Yes. We are going to visit our family. Visit us at home. Our family. Visit. Visit our family. Did you finish? Yes. Me hace falta una. Ok, continue, continue. <risa> Tienen que tener todas las mismas. A cualquiera del grupo le vamos a preguntar. Vamos, sigan trabajando. Ok. Okay, I am going to give students one minute for them to come back. We have checked the different rooms on which they were working. I am going to send them a message that they have one more minute. So I hope they are going to come back with their job done. Let's stop this so they can have the 60 seconds to join back. Okay, welcome back everybody. Welcome, welcome. Excellent, I have many of you back. I am missing only six people to come back. Group number two, they haven't finished. Most of them are back, okay. Very nice. From group number one. In group number one, I had Cesar, Daisy, Elmer, Julio, and Noemi. Let's ask one of them to give us what they are going to do on the week. Do you have any volunteer assigned? ¿Ya habían asignado a alguien en el grupo o lo escojo yo? Yes. No lo okay, so uh, let's see. Noemi, please, can you tell me what the group is going to do during the week? Okay. The group are going to, we are going to work on Monday. Okay. We are going to go to the week on Tuesday. Very nice. We are going to go to work on web, web this day. Wednesday. Wednesday. <laughs> Wednesday. You are going to go to work on Wednesday. Good. Continue. We are going to go to the basketball on, on Thursday. On Thursday, you are going to go to play basketball on Thursday, uh-huh. Uh, we are going to go to the supermarket on, 
on Sunday. Very good. Y we are going to go to the Friday. You are going to go to the last one. Can you repeat the last one? La última. Es la, la única que no puedo escuchar muy bien. La última. Yes. We are going go to the shopping on, on Sunday. Okay, we are going to go surfing, right? We are going to go surfing. Very good. Thank you, group number one. Fantastic job on the sentences. Very good job on the sentences there. Group number two, we have David, Juan, Rocio, and Janira. Who is going to give me the sentences? The chair. Yes? No teacher. We divide the days. Ah, okay, good, good, good. Excellent, go ahead. The first one is me. Uh, we are going to go Cancun on Monday. You are going to go to Cancun on Monday. Good. We are going to work in the plasma on Tuesday. Very good. Number three. We are going to visit my teacher on Wednesday. <gasps> My God, I am going to prepare a chicken soup for you. Very good. The next one. Con esta sí tenemos un poco de duda. No sé si es así. We are going to study homework on Thursday. We are going to study homework or we are going to do homework. We are going to do. We are homework. going to do. Ah, yes, okay. we are going to do homework. Next. Thank you. We are going to go eat restaurant Puerto La Libertad on Friday. You are going to go to eat at a restaurant in Puerto de la Libertad on Friday, okay? With your teacher, right? Yes, teacher. <laughs> okay. Good, very good. The next one. Excellent. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. We are going to go well, to a park on Sunday. You are going to go to walk Repeat. at the park. To walk. Uh -huh. at the park you are going to go Sunday. to walk at the park on Sunday. Very good. Perfect. There you have the three okay. prepositions, right. right? Very good. And that's it, right? And Janira, what are you going to to mention one? No. Janira no le dejaron ninguna Janira. That's it, right? We have. Okay, okay, don't worry. We are going to to take a, take the vacation or for visit the cathedral of Santa Ana. Hey, you are going to take the vacation to visit the cathedral in Santa Ana. That's very right. nice. Very good. So we are okay. going to be waiting for you here. Excellent job. Very nice. Con mucho gusto lo recibo en mi casa. <laughs> Very good job. Number three, group number three. Carlos Regalado, Edwin, Joaquín, and Josué. Who is going to give me the sentences? I don't know the seat what member is work the answer. Okay, who is going to give me the answer? Carlos, Eduardo, Joaquín, or Josué? Uh, Carlos. Eduardo. On Monday, we are going to go to Metro Centro. Good. On Tuesday? We are going to study. On Wednesday? We are going to stadium. You are going to the stadium, hey. Uh -huh. Let's see, Carlos, on Thursday? We are going to go bar on Tuesday. You are going to go to the bar on Thursday. On Friday? Uh -huh. Friday is... Uh, we are going to go 
pizza. Friday. You are going to go to eat pizza and Joaquin on Saturday. We are, we are going to go go to the park. You are going to go to the park and on Sunday, Mr. Josue. We are going to go beach. You are going to go to the beach, right? We are going to go to the beach. Very good job. Only boys, right? You are going to do boys things. Very nice. Group number four. I have Ana, Jenny, and Jorge. Voy a iniciar. I, I, Go ahead. Start. I start. Go ahead. Uh, we are going to travel Paris on Monday. <gasps> wow. What a nice thing. You are going to go to Paris on Monday. On Monday. Number two. Uh, we are going to study English on Tuesday. <gasps> In Paris. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> on Wednesday. <laughs> Um, and then we are going to to do exercise. You are going to exercise in I'm Paris. <laughs> Very nice on uh, Thursday. On Thursday, we are going to dance. You are going to dance. Uh, let's see who is going to continue. And we are going to go to the beach. The beach. On, Friday. on Friday. On Friday. Very um, nice. We are going to climb to Everest on Everest Saturday. Monday. You are going to climb the Everest on Saturday. It's like, yeah. I, I, es about que es vamos, vamos al Everest. Okay, that's nice. On Sunday. On Sunday, we are going on to visit day. our family. You are going to visit your family, right? We are very rich. <laughs> I know, I know you are very rich, right? So number five, very good job, ladies. Very good job, uh, Mr. Jorge, Anna, and Jenny. And the last group, Abigail, Elba, Evelyn, and Ingrid. Go ahead. Who is going to share the answers? Abigail, Elba, Evelyn, and Ingris. Chin, chin, chin. Thank you, Elba. Go ahead. Can I pay the microphone? Yeah. We are going to walk in the park on Monday. Excellent. We are going to play volleyball in the afternoon on Thursday. Very good. Thank you. Yes. We are going to go to the movies on Wednesday. You are going to go to the movies on Wednesday. Evelyn, continue. We are going uh, to eat pizza on Friday. On Friday. Friday and Saturday is we are going to Salón de belleza, no sé cómo se dice. We are going to the hair salon. We are going to the hair salon. To the hair salon. In Saturday. On in, Saturday, uh-huh. Saturday. In, we are going to, to have lunch with my family in Monday. Okay, so you are going to have lunch with your family on Monday. Very good sentences, my dear students. So we finish with all the activities that you are going to do. Enjoy your trips to Paris and to all the other places that you are going to be visiting. Okay, good. Very good sentences. Very good participation, the one you have. So in order to wrap up with this topic, I have here different occasions and different special celebrations eh, that we have in our lives, right? We have Mother's Day, Father's Day, graduation, wedding, anniversary. And here I have different activities that we do on each of the celebrations. Here we have send cards, enviar tarjetas, right, or cartas. 
The next one, give presents. The next one, take pictures. Sing songs. Dance. Eat cake. Have a party. Have a picnic. Eat a special food and wear a special clothes. In which of the celebrations you do the different activities? For example, in Mother's Day, what activities do you do? Do you have a picnic? Do you take pictures? Do you give presents? Do you eat cake? Do you dance? Do you eat special food? What activities do you do on Mother's Day? Listen, give presents. Give presents. Do you give presents? Present. Present. Sing a song. Have a party. Dance. Sing a song. Eat cake. Eat cake. Have a party. Eat special food. Special food. Special food. Wear special clothes. Do you wear special clothes? Do you take pictures? Take pictures. Take yes. pictures. You take pictures and do you have a picture? No. No, yeah, right? Mm, no. Okay. Wear special clothes means that you have a very special outfit, right? Como en su graduación, que tenía una ropa especial. Como en su boda, que tenía ropa especial. O si ustedes sacan el mejor outfit para el Mother's Day, that's perfect, right? That's the perfect. only person who clothes, wearing special clothes that day is the mother. No, exactly. So they wear a special clothes. What about for Father's Day? Nothing. Send the car. <laughs> Give present. No, only, send only the cards. father is like. Yeah. <laughs> you send cards. Give a song. Eat a party. Do you it's have a cake. party? It's cake. No. It's cake. Uh -huh. it's cake. Have a party. Uh, eat a special food. Eat a special food. And <laughs> wear a special yeah. clothes. No. Drinking no. beer. <laughs> drink beers, right? <laughs> you drink beers, right? Uh -huh. they, there, is, there is a very good and funny meme that say like, for Mother's Day, a lot of celebrations, right? <laughs> for Father's Day, nothing. Whatever. Because Whatever. they are back. No, no, come on. <laughs> uh, well, I have a very good father, right? So I, I, I don't have good. to. But that's nice. <laughs> so, but yeah. So maybe one day you are going to be a father or you are going to have a husband <laughs> there that it is going to be a very good father. For the graduation, what do you do for the graduation? Give a present. Send cards. Take pictures. Dance. Take pictures. Dance. You dance. You eat have cake. A party. Okay. Have, have a party. Have a party. Eat a special food. And you wear special clothes. Wear right? Special, special clothes. Special clothes. Very good. For the wedding, you do everything as well, yeah. right? For the wedding, you do all the yeah, things. Yeah. And cards. And cards. You do all of them. Okay. And 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 you don't have a party. You don't have a party. Okay. Have a party. No. Have a party. No. Have a party. Have a special club. With a special yeah, maybe yeah. if the maybe if the wedding yeah. is uh, in a park. Yeah, if the wedding is in the park, right? You you have a picnic, right? Yeah. For the anniversary. Uh, send card. Give a present. present. Uh -huh. Sing song. Okay. Do you dance. sing songs in the anniversary? <laughs> yeah, party. Well, like the Flintstones, right? A menos que sea como los pica piedra. Music, happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Oh, the, <laughs> okay. uh, the trios. <laughs> the trio. Well, that's good. That's good. You dance. Do you eat cake in the anniversary? No. Yeah. No, no, no. Well, yeah. hitting, no. hitting El Salvador for no. everything. Pupusas. Everything, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> eat yeah. pupusas. If, if, it, if, it is, if it is Kaiser's birthday, cake. If it is anybody, yeah. cake. Oh, it's Monday. Cake. cake. <laughs> Everything cake, right? So, cake. Cake. <laughs> okay, there you go. Uh, you, you, maybe you don't have a party, but you eat a special food. And in some cases, you wear a special clothes, right? 
have a picnic. You can have a picnic. Also. Right? You can have a picnic. So, in the case that you say, well, it is Mother's Day, we are going to send cards. We are going to give presents, give presents. take pictures. We are going to sing songs. Okay, if we are going to use the structure of going to. Very excellent exercise, my dear students. So uh, in this case, we have just a little example of the questions, the questions with going to. What is your favorite holiday or festival? And for this one, I need one volunteer. Vean, quien es el más activo ahorita? Eduardo, what is your favorite holiday or festival? Um, what, um, my favorite. Uh -huh. uh, Easter week. Easter week. When is it? When uh, is it? Um, um, between March or April. Okay, I think it's in April this year. Where are you going to go on Easter? Are you going to travel? Are you going to do anything um, special? Um, I'm going to go to the beach. Very good. Who is going to be there? Who is going to be at the beach with you? Uh, with my family. With your family. And how are you going to get there? How are you going to get there? By microbus, by motorcycle, by bus, by car? Uh, um, I drive my car in okay. my car. By car. So you say by, by car. car. Good. By another car. another volunteer who can survive. Claps for Eduardo. He did a very good job. Very nice. Okay, very good job. Mister, you survived to my questions. ¿Quién más cree sobrevivir a las preguntas? Vean. I think... Chen, 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 chen. Elmer. Elmer has the willingness on the face. Elmer, what is your favorite holiday? My favorite holiday is Christmas. Christmas. When is it? It's a... Uh, um, December 25th. December 25th, very good. What are you going to do? Excuse me, teacher. Can what? You speak <laughs> what are you going to do? We are going to do what? Here you have the activities. Ahí le puse las actividades. What are you going to do for Christmas? Mm, we we are going to visit my family. Okay, you are going to visit family. Very good job. And let's see. How are you going to go to visit your family? By bus, by taxi, by car? I'm going to drive my car. Very good job, Elmer. You survived the questions. My last part of the class. I am going to assign this part that it's on the on the uh, platform. I need you to practice the reading, okay? Because we are going to use it in the class tomorrow. So I need you to go to the platform and practice the reading, okay? This is the last exercise for section one. You are going to find it there and I am going to send it to your WhatsApp as well. También se lo voy a enviar al WhatsApp para que practiquemos la lectura. Okay, we are going to use it tomorrow. Tomorrow we are going to practice um, section number two, that it's about the parts of the body. So please, I need you to investigate a little bit about health problems because we are going to use that in the next unit. Okay, so investigate a little bit about health problems and the parts of the body. We are going to use them tomorrow, okay? so. Have a beautiful night, my dear students. I am going to see you tomorrow for another class.
Good night. Have a good night. Good night, good night teacher. Bye-bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye, Bye. 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 Bye.